I am Ken Ndiye Bodari, I'm the country manager for Zoho Technologies Limited Nigeria. Now, seeing as Zoho is an organization for other organizations to work with, and looking at how the economy right now is, I'm not going to say crippled, but it's crippling, it's getting there, yeah. right? How exactly is Zoho making it better, making it good for these organizations to work using their systems? Um, I would say what we're trying to do right now in the market, and what we're currently doing in the market is to reduce the access level, the entry barrier for technology. So any business owner in the country that is trying to scale up their business or even to merely sustain and remain in business, okay. they need to find a way to use technology to run their business. So either they have to do their digital marketing, they have to optimize their sales process, or even their finance activities. So on our platform, we have a lot of applications that can actually help them do that at a reduced price, no better price, but then they get access to quality software and technology to run their business. So the economy is crippling, is bad, but then your business does not have to really feel that impact if you can use technology to sustain it. So the cost of technology can be really, really crippling. You know, but then Zoho is in the market, so we call something localization, right? So we're trying to localize our products to help small businesses in the country. Okay. Now, speaking about helping small businesses, that 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 one, let's just put that aside for now. Yes. What exactly is the difference you're bringing? Because you're not the only organization doing this. No. Yes. What is the what's that big that thing you're doing? What's that leadership position that you have in the market that is different from what other organizations that are doing what you're doing? What are you bringing? So we're bringing three things to the market. Number one, we're bringing security and privacy. Uh, because it's very important for any business owner to know that their platform they are using is very secure and private. Mm -hmm. Secondly, we are trying to do, we are bringing localization of our products. So Zoe is a multinational company with global head office in India and all. But then we are trying to build a local flavor into the Nigerian market. Okay. So when you look at Zoho, you are not looking at it as a foreign company. You look at it from the aspect of doing business in Nigeria, the same one. And thirdly, is the local pricing. I mean, we all know that the exchange rate is not phenomenal at this point, but we build our clients in Naira. So when you remove the access yes. and even the exposure of your business to dollar, and you can actually pay for your software, and I'll probably say we are the only multinational company, tech company, billing in Naira, in Nigeria. We started billing in 2020, far back as four years ago. So when you look at security and privacy, you look at localization, you also look at the pricing model, which is locally priced in Naira. So businesses, will tend to look at us and see that we're actually committed to this market in Nigeria. All right, now bringing the small businesses back, yeah. what is that one thing in just one sentence? What is that one thing you're doing for small businesses? We are doing a lot, actually we're doing a lot of empowerment programs for businesses. Right, we're doing a lot of collaborations with um, government agencies and even big enterprises to bring them to a place where we educate them and also give them access to software. Now thinking about small businesses, we've got a couple of free applications that small businesses in Nigeria can actually use today and then they they can scale up their business. So they don't need to pay and uh, maybe pay heavily for it. Okay. They can easily subscribe to our platform for free. They can get to use some of our products for email service, invoicing software. They can easily pay for it um, with minimum or even no, no price at all. All right, that is very beautiful. Now, before we wrap up, I'd like to know, what exactly are your thoughts on the Business Day CEO Forum? Ah, this is a very, very fantastic event. I am impressed by the lineup of the speakers. I'm impressed by the execution of this event, actually. I am wow. I think this is fantastic. And this is coming at a time whereby leadership is very important. You know, in any organization, even in a country like Nigeria, leadership is very important because if the head is not good, it will trickle down to the body. So having like a CEO forum where everybody comes together, you hear people, you know, you can share ideas, you see, you hear what people are going through in their own sector. And then you can actually pick and see that we can, you know, synergize. So I would say this is a fantastic event, and um, kudos to the organizer of this event. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you.